He's not that good, but have you done Tom Kench? I don't know Tom Kench. I've done some content around Tom Kench, and it doesn't seem like very many people were quite were very interested in the champion. I don't particularly like playing the champion, so I just kind of stayed away from it. You're sober one on his account and your MMR is already better than mine. Well, Riot puts in what's called smurfing MMR for I think the fifty or first fifty or hundred games that you play on a new account, or like a new account to the seasons that has accelerated MMR that's based exponentially on your win streaks. So as I chain wins to get together, like five wins in a row to me does way more for my MMR than it would ever do for you. So you have to take that into consideration for sure. Is it Tom Kench kind of bad right now? Yeah, outside of competitive play, I'm not a fan for sure. I just remembered Annie is a thing. Thoughts on her on the support? She probably can get a kill like with her flash. She's probably not bad, honestly. There's probably better champions, but you can you can probably make her work. You won three of your last 15 games. Yikes. That's a rough go of it for sure. Just want to make sure that I'm Wing onto them and making sure it bounces. I was waiting for him to put his four shot into the minions before, uh, before I walked forward and traded. Alright, I forced out the ward, so now I just want to auto attack the minions and try to guarantee myself level two first. My AD carry is struggling right now. I can just actually straight up ignite him. Hmm. I don't know about flashing in. Okay, what I want to do is drink my pot. I wasn't sure if his Q was up yet, so I just decided to flash. Okay, that's pretty good. Didn't have to use, uh... Didn't have to die. I was going to say use too many summoners, but that's just not true, right? That was a good juke by him. I want to definitely bounce the heal, but I'm not going to go for autos right now. I'm just going to keep eating pots. Okay. Now that I've, like, recovered a decent amount of my HP, should be good to just zone him away. There is still a ward here that I'm aware of. His support should be here pretty soon. Oh, his support is here. Just make sure I juke all of that, otherwise I'm toast. Uh, I think I just give this guy a heal and then I reset. I'll uh, ping him danger too. <laughs> Definitely need to reset here, I'm completely tapped of my mana. I'm not going to be able to generate any more pressure in the lane. Well, I can probably start walking back already. How is Shen support? Rank 4 Korea is spamming it. Oh, that's not bad. I think I've seen a decent amount of people playing it. If you can coordinate Shen ultimates, it feels really good. I personally don't like playing it at all, though. His Shen taunt's, like, pretty short, and he's easily abused in most matchups. Most of his value really does come from being able to flash taunt, set up kills, and, uh... Being able to R across the map. Then I change your mentality. Yeah, that's a lot of solo queue in general, though. Let's see if he walks forward. If he walks forward for it, then. Oh, wow, he's actually just so fortunate. He's gonna get that cannon. Oh no, he didn't get the cannon. Interesting. I need to at least drop a ward down there. Know what's going on. Oh, that guy's not looking at the screen. Make sure I always weave in an auto attack whenever I can. 
Oof. I don't know if that was packet loss or something, but that was some wild shit. I think I'm in my best, uh, I, my best bet is to actually just bubble both of these people and then just keep cutting backwards, drop the ward. Can bounce the heal off of him now. Nice. Yeah. Mostly want to keep everyone out away from my teammate. So I just shoot the bubble at the back line. Because he shouldn't be able to solo him by himself. Let me just cut backwards at that point in time. I didn't want to auto attack because I didn't want to... I basically just didn't want to leave the opportunity for them to catch up to me. I needed to be running at like the maximum amount of speed. Especially since both of them have boots. Oh, he's eating it. He's eating it hard. Go that guy. Okay, we'll bounce the heal off. I actually don't have enough uh, mana to do anything, but he just came from behind, so we're good. Oh, I need to make sure he doesn't die to minions randomly. Uh, I can go for this then. Even if he has a jungler here. Does he need to have enough mana to put his two spells together? I'm pretty close to my to my tier now. I can just reset here and then buy it. Actually, it might be better for me to just stay and help him push another wave. That way the wave doesn't get in the raunchy, raunchy ass spot. He should survive that. Mm. I can't contribute too much here. Yeah, I don't know about running up and chomping him with everyone that low. Oh well, my AD carry actually got hit by something. I actually just save for a fairy charm because I'm gonna go Athenes now that I've got my tier. I personally like going tier a lot. I always find myself struggling with mana on this champion, so yeah, I get tier all the time. Not everybody does it, it's mostly a personal preference build. You body blocked him? Yeah. Nami needs to lose some weight. Also, please remember to type at low pally when you have questions. That way they turn up red so I can see the questions. It's actually really difficult to play the game and read questions at the same time if you're not setting me up for it. Your support 100% has flash. Your AD carry might not have flash right now though. I don't know what he's doing that far out. Did you not try your hardest replacements? Who knows, dude? Do you own Thresh on this account? Nah, but I have Pike. Mostly just eating him to give him movement speed so he can navigate. Just trying to keep him topped off right now since he's eating it in the face. I think I just want the wave to push to me. Then maybe I can hit the, uh... The AD carry. Oof. This guy is... Skill shot magnet. He was just gonna ignite his ass. I can actually potentially beat him. Oof, wasn't able to hit that one. Make sure I bounce the heal off. We'll just keep cutting backwards right now. Oh. Definitely need to run for my life now. 
Oof. Get him, Annie. You can bounce a heal off and give him the movement speed. Go, go, go. No, you need to use your R, bro. He's definitely in range of the RM the whole time. That's some tragic shit for sure. Mm, I'll just W myself. Give him the heal. Oof. Might kill me too. That guy is a skill shot magnet. Yikes. Fucking big yikes. Mmm. I have a lot of skill shots that I want to dodge. Let's just switch over to getting uh, swiftness boots. Alright, the Jin doesn't have flash again, so I might be able to make some plays on him again. The support you by Tyrion? Pretty much only Nami right now. What made you want to pursue, pursue a career as a tour guide? Why not? I can't imagine him staying in lane anymore. Wow, he actually walked forward. Let me just bounce the heal off of him. Just kind of let him fight that out. I want to auto attack him as much as possible, protect him. Nice. Oh, that guy's crazy though. He just walks forward. The absolute madman. Should be able to work down this turret though with four people down here. Make sure I ward things while we're doing this. That way we can see around us whether or not anyone's coming from an angle. Nice. Bottom turret is slayed and my AD carry. I'm no longer tied to. Oof. Hey, it's smurfed on. I think the LeBlanc is running after me. Oh wow, we actually ended up mid losing the mid turret. It's pretty crazy. Plot 5 is an interesting elo. Yeah, one of the hardest thing, you know what actually one of the hardest things about doing the unranked challenger is how rapidly you shift in the elo brackets and like readjusting the way you shoot skill shots and like play against people based on like the level, like the player skill. <clears throat> like within 10 to 15 games, I went from someone who just doesn't juke at all to like a guy who will juke forward. It's definitely hard like adjusting really quickly. Do you buy Ardent and when do you buy it? I'm gonna buy it after Athene's this game. So, like, second item. It's not really a dragon for a while. I have, like, really good vision coverage right now. I mostly wanna get mid pushed out, but I can't, like, comfortably push out mid. I need other people with me. I definitely want a ward down mid lane so I can know if like the LeBlanc is continuously pushing. There's so many people off the map right now that there's so many areas for me to just get caught <laughs> while I'm walking over to this. It makes me feel super uncomfortable. Alright, somehow that didn't go nearly as bad as it should have. Okay, I want to put a wave right across my team right here. Bounce the heal off. Give him the E. Damn, if he had if he had actually done that correctly, he would have had the kill. Nice. I'm not gonna be able to clear the distance for that. Alright, well at least I was able to get there and turn some of it. It was a bit of a wild fight for sure. At least my Kaiser got a bunch of EXP by himself too. 
Hopefully that helps him out. You can get this scuttle crab pretty easily. You always buy Athens on Nami. Yeah, it's really good on Nami. Your heal and your like your heal bounces three times. It's really easy for it to proc and do damage. And then your wave goes across an entire fight, and your bubble does good damage too. Just a lot of easy ways for you to charge it passively without having to think about it. And the numbers on it are pretty good now. I'm gonna drop my refillable and get two pinks also. It's pretty useless now that I'm not laning anymore. Mostly just want to play for the mid turret. I've been told Athene's first item on Nami is trolling. Okay. What was that? What was that statement meant to elicit, though? Uh, I really want better control around mid. I want deeper words. I don't think that guy will go for me while I have Annie next to me. Well, Blanc's running top, so I just run bottom. I just walked over uh, Blue Trinket. Definitely want to get rid of that. I don't want to run into Master Yi. Oh, never mind. I can't run into Master Yi because Master Yi's top because he's the one who had the Rift Herald. I'm just gonna channel back. Rift Herald. There's no point in trying to fight, like trying to race the tempo of Rift Herald. That guy shouldn't be able to get away at all. Can just bounce the heal off. Can just wave across this. I should keep them locked in pretty hard. Oh, he actually one shots me. But I did get ignite on him, so hopefully my teammates point and click and kill him. Excellent. Actually, I didn't get ignite off. I didn't have ignite. I'm stupid. Ouch. LeBlanc's actually such a common pick in lower elo games. Seems to almost always pop off and kill people. Like me, being stupid. Yeah, that was just too far for me to walk up. Their AD carry and mid are really, really far ahead, but our top laner is really far ahead, so we can leverage that pretty easily. No one can help that guy, though. My ankles. That could have been an oof scenario for sure. Is he really not that that skull? Whatever works for you, bro. Seems like it's gonna be pretty difficult to fight over the blue. I'm not sure it's 100% dead. Most part, I'm just chilling. Gotta wait till my teammates group up. I feel like if he doesn't hit the chains on me, I'm okay. I'm actually gonna walk onto the side, that way I have a wave area. Hmm. Maybe that was, well, I mean the turret was about to die, so I had to go there, otherwise it doesn't work anyway. Yeah, there was no way to make that work, basically. I feel like we've lost a lot of trades considering I, I felt like we've been in control of most of the map. Hmm. Okay, I need to flash before he cues onto me. Oh, never mind. LeBlanc killed me. Oof. That brand damage. That's an ouch. Da -na 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 -na. Ooh, 
what happened? Is that it? It's doomed, bro. Uh, this might actually be a game where I need to get my hands on a redemption over Ardent. My AD carry is pretty bad this game, so I better just get a defensive item that I can keep people topped off on. Man, my millionaire is struggling. He's like one of the lowest level players in the game now. Well, it ain't over till they kill our base, so. We must go onward. Mostly just getting words around Baron. He's about to get jumped on by more than one person. Hmm. Let's see what I can do here. Alright, well, good night, sweet prince. Maybe they kill him, but they're definitely going to keep pushing top at the same time. Might be able to kill that guy. Try to bubble on that. Oof. Nice. And he didn't die. That's super good for us. I need to run for my life though. Give him the E. Gotta bounce that heal off afterwards. Aw, oh, I was hoping everyone would keep walking. The Annie actually ended up walking like this, so she wasn't blocking anymore. That sucks. Oh, are we gonna get somebody? Or are we inting? Are we running it down or what? Oh, he's running it down. Rough go of it for that guy, for sure. Yeah, it's pretty hard with that point and click CC for me to handle a lot of the LeBlanc stuff. Ideal vision score, I think it's 1.5 times game length. I don't think he'll jump on me. Damn, I was really hoping he'd jump on me, though. Your wave is so slow that I basically have to cast it the second I think he'll go on me. I can't actually cast it reactively, or else he'll just dash. Yeah, he'll just get out of it anyway. So I just kind of gambled with my wave. Unfortunately, it was not successful. Hmm. Is there any way for me to get to that? Well, if they kill themselves in side lanes and don't do Baron, then that always gives us extra time. I like extra time. Definitely don't want a ward down so I can clear it. I saw that LeBlanc on the bottom side a little while ago, so I should be able to walk over here and at least dump another ward on Baron. I'm always putting it on the very back end, because a lot of people will fuck up their pinks and they won't pink deep enough, especially when they're on the other side of the map, so that's basically what I'm banking on right now. Oh, I think he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Smurfing. Hmm. A lot of these games end up coming down to some random ass fight where someone ends at the start of it, so I can still win this game pretty easily. Especially if we can get a like a good fight for us. Mostly just need to make sure that I don't get one shot by the LeBlanc. If she ever fucks up and then we can blow her up, that'd be really good. I mean, we have an Annie. We should have enough CC for that. Probably running over to Baron right now. Oh yeah, they're on it. I think that's actually dead before we get to it, by the way. People didn't step up far enough and kind of let them uh, 
can wave on that. Maybe we can get a good fight afterwards anyway. I mean, it's 4v5. We should definitely take the fight. No, should keep going. Whoever's pinging, that's wrong. Hmm. I don't think I'm getting the appropriate help that I need, so I don't want to kill myself right now. Hmm. He actually ended up going there. I think that's pretty wrong. Oh. <laughs> wow, he just killed me with two two of his R's. That's pretty tragic. And that's not a stun. Wow. Oof. Big boom mental, for sure. Alright, well, we're closing in on the redemption. Would've been nicer to get a better fight for that. Wait, this guy just hasn't stunned like two or three times. It's pretty crazy. Wow. This is something else to watch. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, there we go. There's the anti stun after three fireballs. Fucking LS Prodigy. Like one of their strongest champions. Okay, I'll wave on that. Try and back him up. Bounce the heels off. Make sure I keep everyone topped off. I can't imagine him going on, man. Hmm. Well, unless he has ultimate or something. It doesn't seem... Still don't think that's worth his flash. Uh, I kind of need help over here, bros. Well, we got his flash off. This is a rough one for, for sure. I don't have wave or anything. It's a little bit harder for me to get stuff done, get stuff going. I'm just gonna back off and get my redemption right now. I guess he didn't see this word. Alright, uh, once you start losing the map, it's usually just important to ward down the lane so you can see how many people are grouping on any given like location for sieging. Like, this is a good ward, it's a good ward. Probably try and get a ward like here. Huh. I don't know about that one. I can wave on that though. I'm gonna make sure I ignite him so he doesn't heal anymore. Any deaths means that they just don't have as much power grouped, so I'm okay with it. I have to ward over the wall though, because I don't know if they're gonna keep pressuring or not. They're actually all bottom right now. All right, Annie, you press Q onto LeBlanc, we maybe win. I can't guarantee something like that, right? So just maybe, maybe we win. Try and hit a bubble on that. Okay. My teammate couldn't handle it, but it's okay. Sometimes it's hard to press Q on a player. Hmm. Is it worth my flash? Probably not. We did turn them again. Uh, Is this guy gonna do something dumb? That's the fucking question I have on my mind. Oh man. Looks like my teammate was the one who's gonna do something dumb. They're all on the bot side right now, so I'm just gonna clean words.
My cost is pretty um maybe it's not a good idea to fight. Okay, let's wave on that because you should dash on him. Give him the E. Oh, I suck it. This game. Good night, friend. The 13 kill LeBlanc is a little bit of an issue for sure. Oof. Good night, friend. Not even Annie could help could save us from this game. LS is prodigy. Just pick Annie. Alright, go get him, Captain. Oh, I have no idea what just happened. No, you're supposed to kill LeBlanc, bro. Try and shoot the bubble as he comes out. No, fireballs. Fuck. Everything's bouncing. Cooking my head, cooking my fucking body alive. Ah, uh, damn it. Alright, well, we tried this game. The ball gets smoothing. Yeah, it's pretty difficult to deal with that guy for sure. <laughs> my 80 carry is level 15, the other block is 18. That's some rough stuff for sure. That's the line of Archangels yet. Get coach, son. Dude, I got fucking lit on fire. I need to flash faster. I need to process that a fireball was like bouncing around on my team and flash way faster. I don't know, it's pretty hard to defend at this point in time because they can just walk over and take Baron again because they kill it instantly. Damn, their carries are so strong. Yeah, their AD and mid are quite powerful. Despite their brand just like suiciding every fight, as long as he presses R and makes it bounce around with uh, how strong his carries are, right? he's a little bit easier of a job than I do. <laughs> Working towards Archangels, but I'm not convinced I finish it before the game's over. Yeah, because I needed Annie to press Q on the LeBlanc in a team fight like five fights ago, so that's pretty difficult. I was trying to get words over the wall so we can see if maybe the LeBlanc is standing there. Give us some preemptive knowledge. I don't know what that pillar is supposed to do, but I don't think it did what it needed to. Suicide Bomber Brand. Yeah, it's something like that. <laughs> Can't win them all, it's fine. Alright, we should be able to win this fight, right? Just press R on it, man. Oh my goodness. Whew. I need to dump a redemption right here. That way I can recover. Bounce the heal off, which bounces onto my other teammate. It's fine. It's fine to lose the game, because at least we wipe them. That's worth. Like, even if we lose the game, my KDA was much better by winning that fight. Just kidding. KDA ruined. Fuck. <laughs> 